Okay, I'm going to try and mark a B. I have my bottle of paint and my screen. Here we go. I don't know if it'll disturb them too much. And they won't come back, but I'm going to try it. Okay, that didn't work. Let's find a different spot. Okay, I found a better way to mark bees for timing. Got my paint and my paintbrush. Forget about the. We'll just catch them. Try to catch them by two wings, or else they want to sting you. Okay, away we go. Oops, dropped that one in the water. She's okay. Uh, if she's going over there to land on a piece of grass to dry off, I guess. There's a dead bee. That bee got too close to the water and drowned. Okay, I got an even better idea. Don't try to pick the bees up. Just try, try to put a dot of paint on them while they're drinking. Gotcha. Sort of. Paint's drying up. Oops. That one I got on its wing. Okay. Sorry, B. She's not going to be able to fly now. Gotcha. Okay, I'm going to go try this on my other favorite bee over here now that I've had some practice. So I picked up the bee with the botched paint job and I brought it back to the nearest colony. The guard bees wouldn't let it go in. So maybe it smells like Testor's model paint or it wasn't from this colony in the first place. Lots of bees on the rabbit brush about the third week in September. Alright, I caught a bee on the rabbit brush with my butterfly net and now I'm going to put it in my little marker here and see if I can glue some Christmas tree tinsel on it and see if I can follow it easier that way. Alright, I super glued it on. Now the bees crawling through the sand, getting sand all over the super glue too. And uh, I don't think it's going to be able to fly. Okay, I'll try this another way. I glued some tinsel on to another bee, but I think it's too big of a piece. It's going to interfere with its wings. I don't think it can fly. I need a smaller piece of tinsel. Even a smaller piece. There wasn't any Christmas tree tinsel available, so I used a party hat. And I got super glue. There's a gel type doesn't seem to work as well as the regular, and I don't know that either one of them worked that great. Maybe I tried gluing it to his leg. My only other idea this evening is to look low in the sky when the sun's at that kind of an angle. You can see lots of insects. Except there's too many insects to see whether they're honeybees or not. So, maybe I'll try again another day.